Um, one of the biggest things that God has taught me over this past year um, is just to be sure of your calling and the ways that God has equipped you. Um, you're about to enter one of the most exciting journeys of your life, and it's going to be kind of a whirlwind when you get to the college. You're going to be getting to know your session mates and the staff, and it's all very new and exciting. Um, but once you start to settle in to your schedule, that very specific color-coded schedule, um, that's when Satan kind of creeps in and he starts to work. Um, and one of the ways that I was discouraged this year is um, through comparison. Um, and I learned that comparison is the thief of joy because um, Satan will start whispering um, things into your mind and saying, well, look at this cadet. You know, she has the gift of preaching and you don't really have that. You don't have that confidence. Or um, this person is gifted in prayer and if you just listen to them, um, you don't really have that gift either. Um, and there are various things um, that the, Satan will say just like that because God has called and equipped us all in different ways. Um, but be sure of the ways that God has called you. And I remember um, one of the uh, sermons that Heidi Bailey came and spoke to us talked about just that very thing, that Satan's going to come and he's going to creep in and he is going to say all kinds of lies and things to tell you to get you to doubt your calling, to get you to doubt the reason that you're there. Um, but be sure that God has called you, he has equipped you, and as Jeff said, you're exactly what he needs and what he's looking for. So don't ever doubt when you look around and see the gifts um, and the ways that he's equipped other people because he needs you the way that you are. And I wanna share a verse with you. Um, it's a verse that I put on my little bookmark last year and a verse that I um, spoke in my calling at training school, but it's a verse that has stayed with me because God has continued to speak this to me and encourage me um, with this. It's Philippians chapter 1, verse 6, and it says, Being confident of this, that he who began a good work in you will carry it on to completion until the day of Christ Jesus.